If you are somebody who is using tools like Canva to create designs for your social media, for your marketing or whatever for that matter is, keep watching this video because I'm going to show you an amazing tool today, which is probably the best and closest and the cheapest alternative to Canva for one time cost. All right. Without wasting more time, I'm going to jump right into the screen right now. I'm going to show you the tool and how to use it and everything you can do about that tool. But before that, make sure you click on the subscribe button, hit the bell icon. And if you like the video, only if you like the video, drop a thumbs up. I'll be very, very happy with that. All right. With that being said, let's jump right into the screen. And this is Crello. What is Crello? Crello is probably the best alternative to that of Canva and Canva Pro more importantly. Now you might be wondering, Weber, what is Canva Pro? So there are a lot of you who must be like watching this video right now who might have been paying for the premium version of Canva. By the way, before I go there for all those people who don't know what Canva is, Canva and Crello are these tools which will help you to edit pictures like a graphic designer without knowing anything about design. You don't need Photoshop, you don't need any skills. There are a bunch of templates that you can make changes to if you replace images, replace text and so on and come up with beautiful creatives just in a few minutes with a few clicks. That's what Canva does. That's what Crello does. But Canva is a much more, uh, you know, famous tool. It has raised multiple rounds of investments and some much more, how do I put it, uh, uh, older tool with more features, right? And there is a pro version of it. There's a free version of it as well, which is very, very decently powerful. But most for most of the users, you might have to upgrade to the premium version because the premium version will give you 60 million photos, thousands of fonts and so on and on and on. Something that I kind of miss with Canva Pro is teams. I might have a graphic designer. I might have multiple designers. I might have a content team and I want every each one of them to be able to access the same account. For that to happen, I need to contact for enterprise, which I have, and they asked us to pay minimum of 10 users at $30. So I have to invest $300 per month to be able to use the enterprise based on what I understood last time. But that's where I am. That's when I decided to move to Crello. Now, what does Crello do? Crello basically has almost all the features that a Canva has. But the beauty of Crello is that it gives you more images, more stock images, more templates, and also on top of that, it allows you to create teams and collaborate on designs. You know, think about the pricing. This is $8 while Canva is $10 per month when you pay yearly. But, well, I'll tell you why I'm creating this video. I'm creating this video because there is a lifetime deal running on Crello. Crello, like I said, this is the tool, which is probably the best alternative. And right in a few minutes, I'm going to dig deep into what all can these tools do. And we'll do a quick comparison. But the beauty is you don't have to pay this $8 every month. Instead, you can pay $49 once and get Crello for life with all the pro features, with all the teams. And the best part, you can try it for 60 days. And if you don't like it, you can get a cashback. Now, you know why I'm creating this video so that you, I just wanted to make sure that you guys don't miss out this deal because this deal is ending in six days. And I thought it's kind of my responsibility to share it with you people when an awesome deal like this comes in, right? So there you go, guys. Let's quickly play with both the tools, right? For that, let me quickly log in on both the tools. I have bought the premium account of, uh, of a, a Crello as well as uh, a Canva, right? So we have uh, two access to both the tools, right? So let me quickly log in here as well. All right, there you go. I have quickly logged in into my Crello account as well as Canva account. Let me quickly show you how can how Crello works first, and then we'll compare it to Canva and what all Crello skips in that, all right? What all can uh, Crello doesn't do that Canva does, and what are the things that Crello does which Canva doesn't? All right. The first thing, if you look at it on top, right, you can see a bunch of templates that you can choose from. Let's say let's let's play with some. Let's say Instagram post. All right. I've just got the lifetime deal of this because it's a no brainer. Right. So there you go. When I look at Instagram post, there are hundreds, in fact, thousands of templates that I can pick from on the left side. Very similar flow to that of Canva if you used it. Right. Let's say I have a webinar. So probably select this. There's a nice little icon and a design. So I can say, I can change this to, let's say, webinar. There you go. Let's say I'm doing a webinar on growth hacking. <clears throat> All right, looks pretty nice. And let's say I change this to my website. 
simply if i want to make this bigger right i can just drag and drop this and there you go the size has changed so there you go it looks pretty nice already right i mean you saw how easy it is let's say there are some, there are these icons and let me let's say for some reason i want to replace this icon right so where are icons i could probably go to objects where i can find a bunch of icons and i also can go to animations which is something that canva doesn't have or is a premium feature right so let's say i want to i don't know let's say I look for a computer maybe let's see if i can find a computer there you go let's say this is the icon that i want to use because i want something dynamic so i can quickly delete this drag and drop it here look at that we have just made a animated there you go if i click on this play button I've just created an animated creative for my growth hacking webinar that I'm doing next week. How cool is that? Let's say I want to add some text on top of this. Let's say I want to put in the date, which is obviously very important. I can go to text, select something. Let's say I will select subheading. Right there you go, it has added. Let's say I will say 4th September, which is my birthday as well, if you want to send me some gifts. <laughs> All right, uh, 4th September, 7 p.m. Let's say, all right, I can select this text and also change the font and everything around that. Let's say I'll go with Nunito, which is one of my favorite fonts, right? And I want to make it bold and I want to change the color. Here you can see you can change the color as well. I don't know why I would pick a color like red, but then, you know, sure. It's going to give our recommendations as well based on design. So you can see there's a pink here. So it automatically has that palette, uh, uh, you know, uh, being shown here. So there you go. I've edited the text. I can just drag and drop and move it looks nice right maybe i have to align this on right inclined i click on this it moves to right inclined that's it looks pretty nice just click on this download button and we'll have the creative ready looks very sweet according to me so that is what it can do now let me show you some real power of crello that is when you go to photos there's something called premium stock and free right what is premium what is stock and what is free so premium images are images which are not available for free users Okay, and these are all the images that basically you would have paid for, but you're getting it for free. All right, with this tool. And there are like hundreds of how many images? I mean, I think it's about 160 million images or something like that that comes for free, while Canva doesn't have a lot of images. If I go to Pro, there you go. There are only 60 million photos uh, and elements which are not even free. Right, you have to go for a premium version if you want to get images. But with Crello, if you have taken the paid plan, which is $49 for life on this, you get all these images, stock images from free. By the way, guys, all these photos are coming are coming from some, something called as deposit photos, which, which uh, Crello has a partnership with, which makes it more interesting as a tool. So this is deposit photos, which is one of the biggest alternative to Shutterstock right and all the images that are on deposit photos are with crello and just to give you some perspective you basically are getting images which is about one dollar per image for free with the crello lifetime deal so all the images that are on deposit photos are on this premium images as well let's say i want to find someone using a computer again i'll just look for computer and there you go i've got a bunch of images where people are using their computers all right for some reason if i want to use one of these images in my thing, I can just drag and drop it and I can put it anywhere I want. Okay, for some reason, let's say I want to use this image, so I should not be using this image, which makes no sense to use the image here, but you get the idea. And once you do this, let's say I want to move this image to the back, I can click on layering and I can say set as background. And there you go. The background of the image has changed to that, right? As simple as that. So you can do a bunch of things like that. For this example, I'm going to keep it simple, but you get the point. You are getting all these images for free as well. Now, if I jump to, if I click on, if I go back to Credo, right? Here we have simply made a design really fast, a beautiful one. I can click it as, um, download as MP4, JPEG, PNG, and anything that I want. It has an MP4 and a GIF version because you forgot, don't forget, it has an animated uh, icon to it right so that is crello guys you are getting this premium images for free by the way there's something called a stock as well which is basically paid it'll you have to pay extra one dollar but these are coming from other sources if if you don't find anything in deposit photos then you might want to download images from shutterstock and other ones instead you could buy images here but trust me i've never had a problem this has like 160 million images so you'll almost find anything that you want here all right so 
let me quickly jump to Canva now <clears throat> and let me show you what Canva can do for you. All right. In the same way, let me say, uh, let me say Instagram post, just like we did with Crello. Let's find some templates for growth hacking webinar of ours, right? And see what we could find. There you go. There are a few templates on the right as well. Guys, when you talk about quality of templates, I think there is no competition. It's still, I mean, both of them have some amazing templates. So I'm not going to be like, uh, how do I put it? I'm not going to be like, uh, be choosy there. But I'm trying to find a template. Let me look for something like webinar. If I can find something to this. All right. So I found something. It says sustainable response to COVID, which is a webinar template. Looks pretty nice. If you compare it to this, it is okay. Probably have to make some edits. So let's try to add a GIF right now, like an animated icon. There you go. There are some featured images here, which, which are tabbed as free. And you see uh, most of them are pro. If you see, if I, if you hover on them, a few of them are free, a few of them are pro while Crello, all of them that you have here are, you know, you get free access to all of them, right? All the images and all the icons, you get them for free. So there is no paid anymore. So let me look for computer just like we did there. And let's see if we can find something. You can realize one thing that there are not many uh, free version of it. And the number of creative, anything which is decent, for example, uh, this, you can see a similar one. It's actually a pro and you'll see a watermark on top of it. For this to remove watermark, you have to pay for the premium, obviously, for which you have to pay $10 every month. So $12 if you pay it monthly, right? In terms of animation, right? I think you have to again have to upgrade to premium if you want an animation there. If I go back to photos, let's say I'll say computer just like that. They're very limited images. You can see even this is a pro image. This is the only few free images that I can find. Anything which is nice, for example, this is a pro image, free image again, but this is a pro image. So there are a lot of mix of free and pro images. Any good image will usually be a paid image, uh, but that's basically it, right? So I can change the same way I did for Crello as well. I can call it growth hacking webinar, or you can call it free. I can say sysinti.com. Whatever guys, you get the point, right? It's very easy. You can tap on it and edit. You have all the options that there is on Crello with a Canva as well. So you guys get the idea, right? On why it makes sense to have a paid version for both Canva and Crello. But if you are willing to pay $10 every month, I would say go with Canva because probably it has more options. But Crello, if you're going with this Fortnite dollar, it's absolutely a no brainer according to me. Right. So there are other things that you can do with Crello as well. One of the things that I really like is let's say I want to animate this text as well. I can select on the text, click on the animate button and I can just select a animation. You can look at this. You see, not just this is animated, but even the text is animated right now. Right. Let's say I want to do move in and I can say move in from top preview animation. If I play all of it together now, look at this. All of a sudden there is this element, which is moving. There is the text, which is animated and everything like that. Very cool. You could do that, do the same with Canva as well. But again, right, this is something that you can do with Crello with all the images. And by the way, before I forget, they have amazing set of videos as well to be used for free with the $49 pack. Right guys. So that is what I quickly wanted you guys to know about Crello. The other beautiful thing is you can see I have paid marketing and personal account. So if I switch to paid marketing, this is something if I make some designs, right? If I, you, you can select team designs and here all of my teams can create designs and other people can also like, you know, get access to those designs. So let's say I have somebody from my Facebook ads team who want to check out the creators, make a few changes. And we know, and the actual changes don't get edited. So they can come, I can give them access to it by going to the team section and I can go to team settings and give them access to those people. And I can just send them invites and they can literally add uh, and edit those templates. In fact, I can give them access in terms of what they should be able to do as well. Editor, owner or whatever. Let's say I'm just going to put in a demo email and I can send an invite and that's about it. Once they get added, they can be a editor where they can edit every template that I have right there. So that is something which is brilliant with Crello for just $49. While with Canva, you will have to go with the enterprise plan, which is about $30 per user. And you have to take about some 10 to five. I don't know if that has changed. Even if it's one user or two users, you have to pay $30 into two, which is $60. But with Crello, if you are two users, you can use the same account. Uh, and have them as team and you can add unlimited team members who can access your designs. All right. So that is the power of Crello guys. 
So that's it. That's what I quickly wanted to show you people, the power of Crello. While if you think about it, here are some advantages of Canva. With Canva, you have much, much many more creatives that you can handle. You can do posters, you can do presentations, you can do infographics, cards, and so on and on and on. While Crello, it is more focused. Crello is basically more focused on social media and a few things. It doesn't have every option that uh, that Crello, that a Canva has. You can see it is only a specific thing right now for you can see it has posters, a few aspects of it, but it doesn't have every option that a Canva does. But again, right, you have to choose which one is a perfect uh, thing for you. But in terms of everything that I've used, if you want animated versions, if you want to make videos, and also if you have, if you know for a fact that themes or, you know, collaboration is important for you and you don't want to be paying recurring fee every month, $10, $20, $30 per month, I would just say, take Crello. Even if you don't want to use Crello right now, this is what I've done, right? I've kind of still use uh, Canva for now. I haven't moved to Crello completely, but I know for a fact this tool is going to get better and better over time. So <clears throat> yeah, that's what I would say. So the link of this tool is in the first comment. You don't have to look for it. Uh, you can simply go to sysinti.com. You can simply go to sysinti.com slash Crello. You can find the link in the first comment. I mean, in below in the description or wherever you will simply be directed to this. It's an affiliate link. I pay, I get paid about 10%. If you, if you make a purchase through my link, if you don't want me to get that money, that's okay. You can just look for Google search about this tool and buy the tool as well. But again, right. That's the whole point. So that is what Crello is guys. It's very highly rated. Uh, if, if you, if you check out any of the, you know, like review sites as well, it's very highly rated. It's very powerful. I would strongly recommend if you are somebody who's into social media or are a marketer or are running an agency or a startup or anything like that, just grab this because you're going to regret it if you skip this, because the moment I saw this, I just bought it. Like it's a no brainer and it's very powerful. Like I just showed you. So that's about it. That's my review for Crello, very powerful, very cool. And I've moved to Crello. I've moved my designer and myself to Crello right now. So that's it. But if you are somebody who's very comfortable with Canva and don't mind paying, like a lot of people don't mind paying that extra, you know, $30 or $50 per month, because it's not a lot of money if you're running a business, right? If that is the case, it's absolutely fine. You can still stick with the platform that you're using. That is in this case, Canva, maybe for you or some other tool, it's absolutely fine as well. But that's basically what I think about Crello. I hope this video was helpful. Make sure you click on the like button, subscribe and hit the bell icon. I should have said this in the beginning, right? But a newbie YouTuber problem here. But then you get the point. Click on the like, click on the subscribe button, click on the bell icon if you think this video was helpful. And also do drop some comments if you have some questions. I'll be more than happy to answer any of your questions. All right. Again, guys, reiterating myself, the deal is getting over in six days. $49 for life for a tool like this is an absolute no-brainer. All right. It's an absolute no-brainer. So grab it. That's what I would strongly recommend. That's it about this one. I will see you in the next one. Cheers and bye.